Welcome to the lesson two. Uh, as we have already seen the concept of classroom engagement in lesson one. In this lesson two, we are going to see the importance or benefits of classroom engagement. Please use the discussion forum in the call to share your ideas, views, any question or suggestion, anything with us on how you engage your students in your class. Uh, the learning objective of this lesson two is at the end that I'm hoping that you'll be able to identify the importance of classroom engagement. But before we get into our lesson, let us have a simple reflection spot as always. If you have a notebook or a Google document, please write down the response to the following question. The question says that what do you think you need to engage your students in your class? What do you think you need to engage your students in your class? So let us go deep in our lesson. Before we get into our lesson, let us have a simple reflection spot. As always, that if you have a notebook or Google document, please write down the response to the following question. The question says that, what do you think you need to engage your students? After that, we are going to our lesson. Our lesson is about the importance or benefits of classroom engagement. The first one is it helps students to enjoy the lesson. Uh, engaging the students in a, in a class helps the students to, to enjoy the lesson, to feel that they are part of the lesson. The second one is it helps students to easily understand the lesson because they participate actively in the lesson so it makes easier for them to understand the lesson. The third one, it makes the lesson be active. Students and teachers become active during the lesson because they all engage in the lesson. The third one, it helps the teacher to identify learning styles of his or her students. As we, have, we, we, we all know that students have different styles in learning others are slow learners, others are the quick learners. So by engaging them in the lesson, it helps the teacher to identify the learning style of, of his or her student. The other one is it facilitates the teaching and learning process. The teaching and learning process become easier by engaging the students, by engaging, uh, by making a classroom engagement, by participating the teachers and, and the students in the class, all of them, they feel that, that they are part of the lesson, so the teaching and learning, because the process becomes easier and being facilitated by classroom engagement. The, th the other one, it helps teacher to identify challenges faced by his student during the lesson. As the teacher engage the students in the lesson, it makes easier for the teacher to identify challenges faced by his or her student during the lesson. How can a teacher identify the challenges? Because in the lesson uh, classroom engagement or lesson engagement, for example, if the teacher uses the method of uh, giving an individual assignment, it helps the teacher to know what are the challenges faced by the by individual students. Then after that, it helps. It can make the teacher help the students to overcome those challenges. The other one, it helps students to retain and easily remember the lesson. It helps students to retain and easily remember of the lesson. The other one, it makes the students feel a classroom is a fair place to learn because they active, they are active, engaged in a in a lesson. So the student feel that they are part of the lesson, and they feel that this this uh, this class is part of uh, he or she is part of the class because they feel that he, he is actively engaged in that lesson in that class. So it makes student feel the classroom is a fair place to learn. The other one is. So these are some of the importance or benefits of classroom engagement. 
uh, I've prepared a, a simple video, a short video, which I was uh, which was taken at Kiroka Secondary School. Uh, it was a, a mock examination correction, correction of mock examination. These are some of the importance or benefits of classroom engagement. After that, I've just prepared a short video which was taken at Roka, Roka Secondary School. It was during a MOFO examination correction. Uh, the subject was Kiswahili and the, and the teacher known by the name Mr. Job Alfred Njogoka. I hope that you will enjoy the video because it just show the how the students were engaged during the lesson. I hope you enjoy the video. This will be the end of our lesson two. Uh, our coming lesson, lesson number three, will be strategies of classroom engagement. Strategies of classroom engagement.